The experiment with iCat as a game buddy was set up to investigate whether users can discern differences in personality of a robotic character. In the experiment, the yellow iCat, called Katie, is more extrovert, social and open to the needs of the user. This in comparison to the olive iCat, called Phoebe, who is more introvert and reserved. The personalities were created by means of mechanically animated facial expressions, head gestures and spoken dialogues. Hi, my name is Phoebe. What is yours? Linda. Nice to meet you, Linda. I like playing games. Would you like to play one with me? Yes. Let's play. By showing more emotions through her facial expressions, Katie is more expressive and outward going than Phoebe. I like playing games. The game is called Tic Tac Toe. If you place three crosses in Katie also makes use of gestures to support the spoken message. I win. If it's your turn, my ears and paws will give a blue light. When it's my turn, they'll become yellow. If it's your turn, my ears and paws will give a blue light. When it's my turn, they will become yellow. Do you understand the game? Yes. Yes. Let's begin the game. Please start by placing the first cross. Okay. We start by placing the first cross. Go ahead and good luck. Good choice. Also, in the dialogue there are differences. Katie is more talkative, while Phoebe refrains from using unneeded words. Can you place my knot on field number eight? Ha, I see what you are doing. Please place the knot on the field I asked you to place it. I see what you are doing. I may not have any claws, but my eyes are okay. Katie knows better how to bring an unpleasant message, whereas Phoebe is more direct in her judgment. Place your last cross on the empty field. It's a tie. Better luck next time. Thank you. Thank you for playing a few games with me. I will now go to sleep again. It's a tie. We played equally well. Would you like me to tell a joke? Yes. Okay, here goes. Two dogs meet each other on... To ease the pain of losing, Katie will tell jokes to cheer up users. Katie will also try to encourage users by using motivating phrases. Why did you say, moo? The other dog says, I'm trying to learn a foreign language. Thank you for playing a few games with me. I really enjoyed it. You did very well. You won most of the games we played. I will now go to sleep again. Good night. The experiment has taught us that differences in personality are indeed recognized by users. Katie was perceived as more friendly and more extrovert, while Phoebe was considered to be more sober-minded, just like the experimenters intended. Katie's personality was considered to be more appropriate given her role as a game buddy.